Hello, I'm Seth Johnson with Land House. So I'm here at the tiny house where I've had a lot of problems with ants, as you may have seen. Well, today we're going to be doing some uh, chemical warfare on these ants. So we're going to see if we can get rid of them. Now I've got a couple of different products and we're going to see how well they work because my borax solution did not work after a month. So. This is also borax, but it's a professional grade, and I've also got the spray. So this is going to be put on little dots um, up around the attic, and this is going to be sprayed here on the outside of the building to try and keep these ants uh, from getting in and kill the ones that are in here. Let's hope. Let's get to it. All right, so it may be kind of hard for you to see in this light, but this uh, package has a bunch of these tear-off uh, tabs on here. So I'm just gonna uh, get a couple of those. I'm gonna set them out up here on top of this top plate. Then just gonna take our bottle here and squirt a good sized dab on each of those plates. Maybe I should first open this and pull this off of here. Just bubbling up pretty good. And now I think I'm going to disturb them. see how well they are attracted to that stuff. You can't see it, but they are being attracted to that uh, that stuff pretty good already. Hateful little things. So next, I've got this spray, which is a kill on contact. So I'm hoping that the stuff upstairs will, um, the ants will take it back to the nest and kill the queen but this will kill them from getting out or back into the building. So, we'll see how well it works. So we'll come back to see how those ants are doing. Now if you remember behind me is the uh, bridge I made last year and uh, there's some German wasps that have made a nest underneath. So I got some of this wasp and hornet spray. I know we're using a lot of chemicals today but what else do you do? So we'll spray these bees if we can find them. Wasps, sorry. Okay, let's see if we can learn where they are here. I'm going to toss a rock. Nope, still nothing. Hmm. I don't know where they are. Okay, so I found a stick. Actually, it's a tree. We're going to see if we can get under here and disturb this nest so I know where they are. Something must have gotten to him. How strange. So it may be a little hard for you to see, but this right here is the old nest. So something's gotten in here and uh, taking care of these guys while I was gone. Oh well, thank you whatever you were.
All right, well, I'll bring you back next week and we'll see how those ants are faring with those two different uh, ant poisons. Let's hope it gets them. It's been a week since I put out this professional grade tarot ant killer. Let's tap this thing and see how the war is going. Well, that's a good sign. Maybe this stuff works a lot better than, uh, I see one ant right there. There's a couple. Nothing like before, that's for sure. They were swarming like crazy. So my guess is this stuff is starting to work. Good. What's it been, three months now? So I'd wanted to avoid doing this, but what I'm gonna do is pull back some of this insulation here just to see what our ant problem looks like. So I'm not really seeing them here in this insulation. So I wonder if they were coming in from somewhere else. Huh. Well, there's certainly a lot less of them. I may see a little something up in this corner over here. Yeah, I think the nest was up in there. So, since that other uh, seems to be working, I'm gonna go ahead and do uh, some spraying here. You know, I think we finally did it putting the uh, poison on the outside perimeter and then putting that uh, taro up top and then spraying them again now I think is going to take care of these ants because there were not very many of them left up there. So the borax solution might work if you have the right type of ant but um, this professional stuff seems to have really done the job within a week's time. Thanks for watching. I'm Seth Johnson with Land House and I will see you next time. And if these ants come back, you'll be along for the ride. Bye.